Good morning. Today is my boys, Ruben and Asher's fourth birthday party. I've cried like three times this week because I can't believe how big they are, but today is their party. If you didn't know, we are doing a double theme for this birthday party. We're doing Spider-Man for Ruben and Pokemon for Asher. I've tried my absolute best to do this double theme. It's probably not gonna all be cohesive, but I don't think that they care. The girls went with Justin to church this morning, so they are there. I just have the boys there. They're just playing in the living room with some stuff while I attempt to clean and get everything ready for the party. I still have a while, but I've spent so much time cleaning. Now it's time to start the decorating. And then I have a lot of stuff I need to pick up. Okay, first things first is going to be getting up this banner, which I have to do solo, so we'll see how that goes. And then blowing up all of the balloons. These ones are gonna have helium, hopefully if I can figure out the tank. And then these ones are going to be the arch. a quick little break because the bounce house just got here and they're going to set it up. I requested a bounce house. They put like banners on them for the theme. One Pokemon and one Spidey. They're gonna go set it up right now. <laughs> what is that? The boys were super helpful actually helping me get this all put together so it looks good. I just need to hang it up and then I'm gonna go in with the little clusters and kind of attach them as like an afterthought. I didn't have any fishing line today so I don't know how this is gonna hold up but I'm hoping that it does. But I'm gonna hang this up always right here. Maybe like up high. He will fall. Okay, it's my chair. Okay. Oh, that's good. Far. Yeah. That looks good. Okay, let's go try it out. I love that they were able to do the two different banners. So we've got Pokemon on one side and Spidey on the other. It's literally exactly what I asked for. Okay, I finally finished the little balloon garland. I like this one because I feel like it has Pokemon colors, but it also has Spidey colors. Okay, bad news. Whoever gave this to me, I don't think they knew that it was empty. Maybe they just didn't um, store it, like tightened instead of loosened. So I can't blow up the Spidey balloons with helium, which is a bummer, but I'll just blow them up with my regular machine and we'll find a place for them. I got one blown up and then it just completely ran out. And I would go get some, but I don't think we really have much time and it's not that big of a deal. I'll just use my nifty little doodad. For their goodie bags, I've just got a couple of cute little things. If you guys aren't members of your local buy nothing group on Facebook, you should definitely find one. Um, it is an amazing place to give things away, to receive things that people don't want anymore. Someone was not in need of all of their like old Pokemon cards, so I asked for them so I can use them as party favors for the kids, which I think is so great for a Pokemon party. And the people were so nice, they even repackaged them, like they taped them shut to make them like more exciting, which was just so sweet. So in everybody's goodie bag, I'm doing a pack of Pokemon cards and then we got these little sticker sheets on Amazon Spidey gift. So some stickers, Pokemon cards, and then I wanted to do a little treat. So I got some ring pops because kids just love ring pops. So everybody's gonna get a little bit of everything. These bags are just from the Dollar Tree, they're perfect. I was going to get like really cute little bags from Amazon, but it was way more for something that's literally gonna end up in the trash. They came out super cute. Everybody's got one of everything and I'm hoping this is exactly how many we need because my kids want to have their own goodie bags as well, of course.
Okay, I think I did as much as I could get done today. Justin is on his way home with the girls and then I'm gonna go grab the pizzas. I gotta grab the cakes. We of course are doing two cakes and then I need to get myself ready and give time for Justin to get ready. And then I think we are a go for two o'clock. Okay, let me see. All right, are you ready? Should I have them come out here? Or do you wanna come surprise them in the backyard? What are you doing? <laughs> Me? Are you cleaning up no. after the party? Whoever no. does that? Like, I almost she's like a dad that. on dad on Christmas morning who's got the trash bag with all the presents and like throwing it all away. <laughs> the second that like there's presents out, she's like, let me grab the trash bag. I'll clean it up. Most of the people are gone. It's time to clean up. <laughs> we can hang out and talk. Yes. But we have to charge these too. My mom got them dinosaur walkie talkies with the giant big wheels. We gotta charge these. We've got a charging station already kind of going on up here. Okay, we had everybody else leave. We just got family here now, and of course, Kaylee and the kids and Patrick, because she was helping me clean up. Everything is mostly cleaned up, except for the toys and all of the stuff outside. So fun, it was a smaller party this year, but it was so fun. We missed all of our family that couldn't make it though. That was sad. It is the next day. We had so much fun, but I'm still so beat. I feel like I didn't sit down all day. Um, tomorrow's the boys' actual birthday, so I'm gonna go out and get like some donuts and some fun stuff to surprise them in the morning. We gave them some of their gifts yesterday, Day, but not all of them so they've still got a couple that we're gonna have them open like on their birthday so like to give them presents on their birthday other than that it was such a great time and they've been playing with their toys all day anyways i'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys so much for watching and we'll talk to you again soon about to leave already packing come with me i'm not really asking we'll get away to a place where we don't about to see the 